Good morning, everybody. This is North Camp Pepper. I want to talk about the um, the Raspberry Pi I got, and this thing is absolutely fantastic. Uh, I've got it doing some stuff right now because it's plugged in, but what, right now I've got it set up as a, uh, a file and web server with just the um, keyboard and mouse dongle and the Wi-Fi dongle set in there. Uh, basically, <clears throat> I'm going to take this to work and have it stream audiobooks from the free audio archive of sci-fi and stuff to my headset, my wireless headset while I work. Um, a lot of free stuff out there, a lot of public domain. Sci-fi is great because it's always it's always new, even if it's in the 1800s. You just update it to your head. Like if I say, oh, so-and-so has a lightning rifle. Well, that lightning rifle looks like whatever. <coughs> so, that being said, this thing's absolutely fantastic. As it is, it's just a perfect web server. Or for surfing the web, I mean, you get on there and do your stuff. Um, I've got some projects planned. Like I said, right now I'm going to use this one for uh, the file server at work on the on the network at work. I'm just going to use their network and let it log in on the public side and go. Um, you can connect a pin to this and do QRP or low power radio. I always want to make an Altoid 10 uh, Morse code can, but this already has it has phone or voice on it already, so you can do that. Um, what I actually plan to do in the future is I've ordered a Bofeng radio. And, oh, you can tell that into it from the field on this thing, too, if you need it. So, there's that. Um, now, you can take it, and um, I'm going to take and put a battery pack on it, like this, here. And plug it in that way, and then I'm going to attach it to the back of a radio. Not this one, but a bow thing. Uh, the radio, I don't care what happens to. This one, I kind of care. But I can attach it like that, and I'll do automatic position reporting, or APR, with the battery pack on there. And every 15 minutes or every half hour or whatever, it'll um, update my info, my location. So if I get hurt or lost in the woods, they can find a search party and, you know, people will know where I'm at if I can't communicate. Like I said, I can update it with my phone, but now where cell phone may fail, ham radio will definitely work because of, you know, frequencies and bouncing off the ionosphere. And there's a whole lot of things why AM is different than FM, but I'm not going to get into that. But... This as it is is the Raspberry B uh, B Plus model. Um, it's excellent. This thing is just absolutely fantastic. <clears throat> I also need to get the GPS board to do the the reporting with the location, but that just plugs in here and it's really really great. Um, you, this is everything you need in the computer. If you if you need to do research or school or a project or something, you need that you can plug a webcam in here and probably work. Uh, I think most webcams do work. Um, it's just really really a fantastic thing. I'm very excited about it with all the things I can do with it. So, yeah. So, take a look at this. I recommend everybody get one. I don't know what all I'm going to do with it. I'm still learning right now. But, um, you know, if you got some cool projects or something, you know, please post below on what it is and I'll see if I can make one. Um, and very cheap components to just add on. Now, I haven't tried any of the Adreno stuff yet. I'm going to work on this right now, but I may try that later on. I hear they work in conjunction and can do all kinds of things. With, I guess Adreno Shields, but I don't, I don't know. But I'm very, very excited about this. Um, it's just such a potential. It's like a Barbie doll for, for technical people and web designers and whatever. It just does everything. I mean, as it is right now, I've got stuff working on it right now that I could serve files or whatever. If you want to make it like a Wi-Fi hotspot, you could do that. Um, and you could parties and. Just add a power supply of some kind, and you can just stream music. I'm going to serve it to all your friends or whatever you want. I don't know. But I guess you can have people running Minecraft servers on these things, too. That'd be cool for a LAN party. But I don't know how that works. Um, okay, so this is what it is. It's very, very cool. Please post your comments below, and let me know if you have any ideas for some kind of cool projects. Like I said, right now it's just being basically a file server, but I'll probably do a little web server on it, too, for fun. For logging something, I don't know. Blo maybe blogging or I don't know. We'll see. Alright, so Ken Pepper, please rate, subscribe, have a great day. Thanks everybody.